Hey guys, Smart of Wim Peters, and today I'm excited. We have the new 10th generation i7 processor. This is not the K, this is the regular version, but let's go ahead and unbox it real quick. Alright guys, so now we got the new design from Intel, as you can tell, the blue nice box looking. This is the 10th generation i7 with the new 1200 socket. They're gonna be using the Z490 motherboards. And on the other side, you're going to have on the box right here, your UPC code with all the details is running at 2.9 gigahertz. And at the top, you have the actual processor. Bear in mind, this comes with the actual heat sink and fan. If you get the K version or the KF version, you will require to have your own liquid cooler or air cooler socket to uh, cool the processor down. So let's go ahead and jump into the unboxing. Alright guys, so we got the nice box right here with the Intel logo and the details. Like I said, 10th 700 with the uh, 1200 LGA socket. You got the uh, specs right here and you got the CPU right here. So if we open it up, you got the nice usual sticker from Intel. Here we go. And we've got the cardboard box. Once you take it out, you got some manuals and instructions. You got the nice sticker now that you can put onto your actual case. As you can tell, this brings a heat sink, as I mentioned before, and they painted it black. So they used this pre-thermal paste. We always recommend for you guys to clean this out and apply your preferred thermal paste. You got the nice Intel logo. Everything's blacked out. So now we got the processor right here, as you can tell, on the traditional plastic wrap and on the other side you got the pins of the actual CPU. Alright guys, so as you can tell you got the full unboxing of this processor. We will be using it for a custom build as I said earlier. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys have any questions you can leave your comments down below or give us a call at Twitter one 647 Thank you.